Nearly two weeks after a Brevard County boy was found dead in an apartment complex, West Melbourne police have now revealed the person who they are looking for. Police say 25-year-old Josh Manns has an active warrant for his arrest on a charge of child neglect with great bodily harm. New 6's James Barbero returns to the scene with the new details. West Melbourne police now confirming what emergency responders reported back on Friday the 11th that the three-year-old boy died here at these apartments on Lago Circle off of Highway 192. Two weeks later, police now believe the person they're looking for could be as far as 70 miles away. That person of interest now identified as 25-year-old Josh Manns. Back on the 11th, dispatch recordings from the Grand Oaks at the Lake Apartments show someone reported three-year-old Jameson Nance was in extreme distress. I had a seizure, not breathing. But then that caller left the apartments before police got here. Wasn't being quite clear where the child was. And then at the end said that he was actually driving away from the scene. From the beginning, police called the three-year-old's death suspicious, but have not said how he died. Police say Manns was last seen at the Colonial and Apopka Vineland Road intersection in Orange County. Around Orlando, police say Manns has also been spotted in the Silver Star and North Hiawassee Roads areas and South John Young Parkway. Police say he's six foot six, weighs about 200 pounds, and he usually wears glasses. He's also believed to have longer hair right now than in his driver's license photo. Police say if you see this man, call 911 immediately. Anyone with information about where he might be can also call West Melbourne Police or Crime Line. In West Melbourne, Brevard County, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news 6.